and the figure AC equal to AE, AB equal to AD and angle BAD equal to angle EAC show that BC equal to DE. So first let's mark AC equal to AE. So I have AC here, this is my AC here and this is AE and they are equal, these blues are equal. This two is equal to this. In the second step it's given to me AB equal to AD. So my AB is here equal to AD is here. So let's mark that too. So this is equal to this. I need to show and it's one more thing is given is BAD angle BAD. So angle BAD is this, this angle BAD. Angle BAD is equal to EAC and angle EAC is this angle. Just to make things easier I'm going to mark this angle as 1 and this angle is 2. So before I start the sum I'm going to say angle 1 is equal to angle 2 and that is given to me. To both these angles I'm going to add this middle part here. I will name that angle 3. So I will have here now angle 1 equal to angle 2 and to that I'm going to add angle 3 plus angle 3. So here adding angle 3 on both the sides. Now when I add so I get 1 plus now I get angle 1 plus angle 3 equal to angle 2 plus angle 3. But what is angle 1 plus 3? Angle 1 plus 3 is this entire angle. Let's name that. That is this angle this entire angle and we write that out that is angle BAC will be equal to what is 2 plus 3 2 plus 3 is 2 and 3 this entire angle this one this angle and we'll name this as here it goes like this EA AD so equal to angle EAD. So keep in mind this we need the uh, to when we're doing the proof this full angle here is equal to. Okay. Now let's mark what we proved earlier. We proved this angle 1 plus 3 equal to 2 plus 3. Now in this sum we're going the two triangles we need to consider are one is this triangle here that is ADE this entire triangle so that gray triangle is triangle ADE this is the first triangle we consider now the next triangle the next triangle is this one AB the yellow one ABC so we write triangle ABC now we need to prove these two triangles are congruent. So to start first we know that in the gray triangle the AE of the gray triangle equal to AC of the yellow triangle that is given. We also have already proved that the angle of the gray triangle we have proved that we have proved look up here EAD we have proved EAD so we have proved angle EAD is equal to angle BAC angle BAC proved this angle here this entire angle we proved is equal to this entire this uh, EAD was of the gray and uh, this one was of the yellow and the last of all we had we had here the of the gray we have AD we have AD of the gray equal to AB of the yellow this is also given to us so here we had by S A S test the triangles were congruent so we have triangle we have A D E 
congruent to triangle ABC by SAS test, which means now BC, which is here, BC must be equal to DE. So DE equal to BC by CP, CT, corresponding parts of congruent triangle. The key take from this sum is this step where you have to show angle 1 equal to angle 2 and you add 3 together and then you get this entire equal to this entire and it is by SES. This S or 1 equal to this S of the other, this S equal to this S and this was a common A.